Can we find Jesus in the Old Testament? Can we find Jesus in each and every book of the Bible? Yes, of course. This is the video about how Jesus is revealed in 66 books of the Bible. The Bible is all about Jesus. The Bible is all about the plan of salvation through Jesus Christ. He is pictured and prophesied in each and every book in the Bible, as well as in countless types in the lives of different characters in the Bible. And here is a breakdown of how he is pictured in each and every book of the Bible. In Genesis, Jesus Christ is the creator. In Exodus, he is the Passover lamb. In Leviticus, he is the high priest. In Numbers, he is the pillar of cloud and pillar of light. In Deuteronomy, he is the prophet like Moses. In Joshua, he is the captain of our salvation. In Judges, he is the judge and lawgiver. In Ruth, he is our close relative. In Samuel, he is a prophet of the Lord. In Kings and Chronicles, he is the reigning king. In the book of Ezra, he is the faithful scribe. In the book of Nehemiah, he is the rebuilder of the broken walls. In the book of Esther, he is the savior of the helpless. In the book of Job, he is the sovereign God over human pain. In the book of Psalms, he is the good shepherd. In Proverbs, he is our wisdom. In Ecclesiastes, he is the meaning of life. In the book of Song of Songs, he is our love. In the book of Isaiah, he is the Prince of Peace. In the book of Jeremiah and Lamentations, he is the weeping prophet. In the book of Ezekiel, he is the turning wheel. In the book of Daniel, he is the fourth man in the fairy furnace. In the book of Hosea, he is the faithful bridegroom. In the book of Joel, he is the spirit and fire. In the book of Amos, he is the burden bearer. In the book of Abadiah, he is the mighty savior. In the book of Jonah, he is the forgiving God. In the book of Micah, he is the messenger. In the book of Nahum, he is the avenger of God's people. In the book of Habakkuk, he is the great evangelist. In the book of Jephaniah, he is the restorer of God's lost heritage. In the book of Haggai, he is the cleansing fountain. In the book of Zechariah, he is a merciful father. Praise the Lord. In the book of Malachi, he is a son of righteousness. When we come to the New Testament, New Testament is all about Jesus. It is about love and compassion of Jesus. When we go through the Gospel of Matthew, Jesus Christ was introduced as King. In the Gospel of Mark, he is the servant. In the Gospel of Luke, he is the son of man. In the Gospel of John, he is the son of God. In the book of Acts, he is the spirit of the Lord. In the book of Romans, he is our justifier. In Corinthians, he is the giver of the gifts of the Holy Spirit. In Galatians, he is our freedom. In Ephesians, He is our unsearchable riches of God. In Philippians, He is the God who can meet our needs. In Colossians, He is the image of God. In Thessalonians, He is the returning King. In Timothy, He is the mediator. In Titus, He is the faithful pastor. In Philemon, He is our friend. In Hebrews, He is the blood that washes away all our sins. In the book of James, He is the great physician. In Peter, he is our chief shepherd. In John, he is our everlasting love. In Jude, the Lord who comes down with 10,000. My dear friends, you can be excited. In the book of Revelation, Jesus Christ is the King of kings and Lord of lords. Hallelujah!